I'm Nick Holder, I'm a historian at English Heritage, and we've come today to Hound Tor. We're in this special landscape with these amazing rocky outcrops called Tors. This one is Hound Tor. In the background, we've got Hay Tor. And what's really special about the place is the hidden heritage. And in particular, what we're going to be looking at is an incredible deserted medieval village where farmers were farming and people were living about 700 years ago. Down in the village of Hound Tor, I suppose it's more of a deserted medieval hamlet in some ways. There's four or five main houses. Each of the houses has a little barn for storing cereal. There's a few smaller outbuildings as well. And behind me, we're standing in front of a longhouse. Longhouses were stone agricultural buildings. There, they combine a house and a place to keep the animals in winter. The walls probably standing six, seven feet, two meters high. Above that, you'd have uh, a thatched roof. Inside, well, in winter, certainly, the animals, your cattle and cows, are actually sleeping and tethered with you at the lower end of the house. Higher up, well, that's where the men, women and children live, at the higher end of the house. We've got a little fire pit uh, for cooking and for warmth. And above that, we've got a more private room for work and sleeping. In the 1200s, we know that there's a man called Richard of Hound Tor, Richard de Hund Tor, living here. So we can imagine it's not just Richard, there's Richard, his wife, children, there'll be brothers, cousins living here. It's a bustling place with cattle, with crop growing, with agricultural activity, with work, with children playing outside. Hantor deserted medieval village is a ghost village. It's an amazing place to get a sense of what life was like here on Dartmoor seven, eight hundred years ago. I think it was a pretty tough place for the people that lived here, but it was a living, thriving community for two or three centuries. And it's one of the best places in southern England to come and get a feel for that vanished medieval world. Mm -hmm. 